everyone hope you all staying healthy and safe thank you all so very much for supporting my channel if you haven't already subscribed please consider subscribing to my channel and if this video helps you please consider giving it a thumbs up as well in column C over here we notice that the names of national parks over here is kind of incomplete to the right so in order to unhide it we'll need to double click between column C and D right here in the vertical line over here or the other way is to click on column then go to format hover over column and then click on auto fit selection we can utilize our shortcut key combination to directly utilize keyboard to select this auto fit selection however in this case over here the key combination over here is not here so in order to add the key combination we'll need to follow a process which I will be going over in a second this process is can be utilized for any other functions over here head and footer comments etc so let's get started with adding shortcut combination key for auto fit selection in order to do so we'll need to click on this apple logo over here to the top left corner and then click on system preferences and then click on keyboard then selecting shortcuts now on the left part of left dialog box we'll notice the app shortcuts over here now we'll need to click on this plus sign at the bottom and then the application that we'll be using adding shortcut key is in Microsoft Excel so that's what I'm selecting over here and the menu title over here should be exactly the same keyword so right here it says enter the exact name of the menu command you want to add the menu command is auto fit selection and then the keyboard shortcut I would like to use is shift command and a so it pops up right over here in the box and then if I click on add this shortcut key combination is added for auto fit selection now if I click on column C and then press on shift command and a this automatically fits this auto fits the names within the column and if you go to format and then hover over column if you notice here to the right side of auto fit selection the key combination that we added is right here shift command and a key combination so this is how you can add key combination in excel for mac hope this video helps you all if this video helps you please consider giving it a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please consider subscribing to my channel as well thank you all so very much y'all have a good day bye bye